Choice Barbecue, North Carolina style. And this man is built for TV. I was already seeing him do some stuff for some live stuff. It's awesome. So tell me, why'd you decide to come to the fair this year? Well, I've been trying to get in this fair for 15 years, Mr. Blake. And this summer, we got a phone call from Mr. Greg. And I was like, Mr. Greg? Who's Mr. Greg? He said, this is Mr. Greg from Jackson, Mississippi State Fair. <laughs> and I said, well, how you doing, sir? And he said, Dre, are you still interested in coming to Jackson, Mississippi Fair? I said, absolutely I am. And that's how we finally got here after 15 years. Yeah, and Josh, check this out. Look, I mean, we got the whole setup. So what do you guys make? In North Carolina style, I just had North Carolina style barbecue for the first time, actually, a couple weeks ago when I was in uh, Wake do, Forest University. We do vinegar-based. We do all vinegar. All our products is vinegar-based. Uh, our North Carolina chop barbecue is what we specialize in. But we num we, we're numerous in other th areas, too. We do the best brisket, smoked brisket, 14 hours long. Uh, homemade macaroni and cheese. It's been in my wife's family for over 100 years. This barbecue sauce, North Carolina barbecue sauce, has been in my family for 125 years. So that's 250 years of nothing but the best cooking in the world out of people that got soul in this system. Yeah, and so talk a little bit about the idea of making a Mississippi connection in this. Because you guys are not from Mississippi, but you said you hired, you wanted to keep the money local in the state. I did. I wanted. To, I like to give back what's gratefully given to us. So I have a brother here. Part of my concept is to travel to cities that I can go to where I got family at. My brother is a deputy sheriff here, Dan King. Uh, I want to give him big shout outs. <laughs> um, and so that's a part of how I got here as well. But as we got here, another part of it is you got to give back to the community. You can't just take all the money away. So and I hired two local young men, very nice guys. One has got five kids, and the other one's got a couple babies. And so we want to help them and give them something to grow and give them a chance to see how they can do something else in life with barbecue. All right. So. I love talking, you and I, but yeah. I think the most important thing... You is, want to taste that barbecue? Is, it, it, yeah, is you the food. You want to taste that North Carolina barbecue. All right, America. so let's take a walk outside and show the... We're going to get a knife here. We're going to get uh, a fork behind you. And we're going to get you some of that barbecue. Uh, LJ, come hand me the sauces behind you. And let's get Mr. Blake some of this good barbecue off the grill. Ooh, this hot. Oh, yeah. Oh, God. This is that brisket that's been cooking for 15 hours, Mr. Blake. So, I don't know, do you like lean or do you like fat meat? Fat meat. You like fat meat, so let's get you a piece of this brisket. As you can see that brisket right there, you see the smoke ring in it. Let me just cut it a little bit so you can see a finer smoke ring in there. Boom, see that smoke ring on that meat right there? Oh, that's what it's all about right there, that smoke ring. So we gonna give Mr. Blake a combination or something. Now, hand me that uh, uh, vinegar-based sauce. Let's put him some vinegar-based sauce on this, LJ. Squeeze this is that. North Carolina side of things. Yeah. It's clear. You can't even see it. Now we're going to only cut you that. We're going to cut you a piece of this barbecue rib right here. See how that rib looks? It's been cooking low, slow, and ready to go. Look, look how I cut that. that so, Dre, what's your favorite part about doing this? we got about 30 seconds left. I love the people. The people is the most important thing to me. When people come and eat this barbecue, like you're about to eat, put some red sauce on there for Mr. Blake so he can get a bite before we got 30 seconds. All right, now you take a bite, and I'm going to hold the mic. All right. And then you tell me what's the best part of it. Oh, that rib just melted in your mouth and not your hands. Thank you for coming to see us, guys, and I hope everybody here really enjoys what we're doing this week. And thank you very much. That sauce is phenomenal. It's phenomenal. I, I like North Carolina style barbecue. I like you, Mr. Blake. Thank you for having <laughs> us on today. Absolutely. I'll give you a little fist bump because I got, right, I got, I got the vinegar. Go. <laughs> Again, 165th State Fair, Dre's Place Barbecue, you North show Carolina style. We'll show out. There you go. We'll be right back. And again, come check out the fair. It opens at 11 a.m. Right across the street from the Livestock Barn, America.